Naya, no, please just listen to me. I heard them. I heard them following us. We can't stay here, Karis. They're coming, and they're going to kill us both. But what of Sister Onaira? We can't just run through the woods all night. I... Forgive me. I don't want to die here. Tonwin, wait. Karis. Despite her fear, there is wisdom in Sister Tonwin's words. You must leave with her. Don't say such things. We can hide, catch our breath, heal your wounds. It's too late for any healing incantations, Bach. Too late for me. But our faith, our faith is the light that must survive. Please. All right. Take this amulet. I rescued it from their thieving hands. And now it's you who must keep it safe. Of course, Elira. Thank you. Rygoch, please protect them. This storm. The very elements conspire against us, too. Tonwin, you're, you're wounded. That's him. He's here. We need to run. <gasps> Curse. No, Tonwen. This can't be happening. You're not going anywhere. Stay away, you monsters. You've, you've taken everything. Strong. Nice try, girl. You are right. He poises to strike. You should flee. No. If you are an ally, then let us fight together. Those teeth are sharper than I thought. I'll just have to kill you when your dog isn't around. Ugh. Come. You can take shelter here tonight. You cannot travel in such a storm. Thank you. Ah, you're up. Thank you, uh, sir. I, I really owe you a debt of gratitude. No worries, mate. And, uh, I found your friends. Figured you'd want to bury them. What? They... I thought they would get away. No, they can't both have died. This can't be real. I can't bury them. I've never performed the rites. It'll be worse if you leave them. Nasty things inhabit the forest. 
I'll dig the graves. Give you some time to say your goodbyes. Tonwin, Unaira, we were meant to escape together. Live together. Without either of you, what would have become of me? The Gwithki is right. I cannot just leave you here. As your souls return to the earth, let Thrygok's providence guide you with his perpetual light into the embrace of his beloved. So you are a dragon priestess. Oh, I suppose I haven't even introduced myself yet. I'm Keres, an encanter of the two dragons. Thank you, sir, for all the kindness you have shown me. Don't fret it. I'm glad you're all right, at least faint. The name's Blethen. What? I didn't expect a Gwethelgi to have a name, mate. No, no. Forgive me. It's a... fitting name. Well... Hmm. There is a merchant who usually travels through this forest. I usually get some supplies from him. Perhaps you could speak with him. We might be able to travel together with him and find somewhere for you. All right. Please, lead the way, Blethen. We can follow the path west of here. It won't take long. You sure you're alright with fighting, mate? I'm fine. Besides, I won't let you do everything for me. Hmm. Well, the trick is to get the enemy off balance. Let's work together to beat it down, all right? Not bad, mate. I say you're a natural. <laughs> you haven't seen anything yet. Now I just need to ignite the magic I left behind. And when his guard is down, He'll stand no chance against an all-out assault. Let's finish this. Hmm. Everything all right, mate? Ah, forgive me. I was just wondering, who was that man that followed us through that storm? How did he track us? Hmm. He had the look of a trained blood hunter to me. Blood hunter? Nobles like to train them. They pretend they're the top hunters in the world, when really they're just copying some old Amperian techniques. None can hunt as well as a wolf, though. I suppose we were just his sport. You don't think he'll come back and try and finish the job? I'm sure we sent him scurrying back to the castle with his tail and pride under his legs. But hey, don't fret me. I'll keep an ear out for him. Thank you, Blethen. Now, let us continue. A noble's blood hunter? I thought it was bandits that raided the temple. Hmm. I don't like the look these guys are giving me. No worries, mate. I'll keep you safe. With them eyeing you, it'll be easy for me to counter them. Thank 
Lucky Blossom. Ah, oh, you're hurt. Well? Cheers, mate. Say, did you feel that rush of power when you perform effectively in battle? Harness that power. Here, let me show you what I mean. Ah, Blevin. You took your bloody time, didn't you? You don't have to wait for me, Thomas. Ah, who were you escorting? Strange to see an encounter so far from a temple. Well, the temple of the two dragons was raided last night. I barely got away with my life. Gaki huge. I usually pass by there to sell my wares. It can't be that bad. There must be some priests still there, right? I don't know. It was truly terrible. I don't know how many survived. Damn. What exactly happened? I... I... Thomas, notice anything unusual on this side of the forest? Hmm, now that you mention it, I did see a mighty number of brambles on my way here. They were absolutely tamping over something or other. All right, I'll check it out. I won't be long, mate. Just tell him to shut it if he bothers you, eh? I bet you hadn't expected a Gwiki to be so helpful. I had never met one before. Such terrible tales I had heard. Murderers who drink the blood of their victims. Monsters of twilight created only to destroy. But last night, I saw true monsters. Their faces far different to his. Blethin keeps these paths clear. 
Though not many know that, they still believe the forest is crawling with all manner of monsters. Gives me the competitive edge, though. This forest is a much safer route than the Red Pass. Guards won't do anything about the bandits there. Where are you travelling to? Klantluch. Despite the state of the old town, I have to support my fellow countrymen, eh? Say they might take you in, being an encounter and all. How about you come with me? Klanluch, after everything that has happened, do I really want to return there? The hunter that pursued me is still alive. Would he seek me? Should I leave? You worried about someone following you? <laughs> Perhaps you could sing a gwichki on them. You could always thank Blethin by playing a card game with him. I've seen him eye in the decks, I have. Silly wolf thinks I don't notice his eyes widen. Ah, think about coming with me, Encanter. You have some time before I leave. I like to enjoy the fruits of this meadow year. You're right, mate. The forest has been disturbed. A large bramble has awoken. I'll need to dispatch it at once. I know which way it went. You two can go on your way, though. It was a pleasure to meet you, Karis. Wait, let me help you. It's the least I can do to repay you. Your incantations would be useful. It's dangerous, however. Are you sure? Of course. No need to worry about me. You take these portions. Stay safe now, won't you? And speak to me if you need anything else. How peculiar. Is this an estate? It looks like it. And locked up tight, too. I haven't seen anyone come to stay for years, though. <laughs> what a waste. So this is what the nobles tax us all for.
There it is. Stay behind me, mate. It's tougher than it looks. And here I was thinking it already seems strong. <laughs> you can still head back if you want. Nonsense. I'm with you. All right. Let's do this. Oh, so swift as it is fierce. You all right there, Karis? Perhaps I shouldn't have brought you here. Hmm. I think I have an idea, but can I trust you? All right. Let's give it a try. What do you need me to do? Stay by my side while I chant. I'll be vulnerable, and I'm sure it'll try to interrupt me. Don't worry. I'll protect you. That was bloody excellent, mate. Did you see that? I was so busy deflecting its blows, but there you were, shining your light on its snapping jaws till it came out blind. Hey, why are you laughing? <laughs> I just wasn't expecting you to become so animated. Hey, well, um, it was a good fight. Glad to have you by my side. Look, some of the animals have already returned to graze at this site. We've brought back balance to the forest. Nature quickly regains her steady feet. Let's return to Tamos. Cheers for the aid, friend. All right. Lead the way, Blethen. Hmm. He praised me, but... Without him, I wouldn't have stood a chance against such a monster. Perhaps he could continue to keep me safe. Ah, you've returned. A smile on your furry face, too. I take it you've cleared the monster? All is done, Tamos. Then I suppose it is time to take my leave. Encanta, will you be joining me?
Hmm. Bless him. Is it all right if I stay with you? Just a little longer. I don't think I'm ready to return to the world just yet. I'll admit I wasn't expecting that. But I think you should do what you think is best. I'll support your decision. Besides, I think I'll appreciate the company, mate. Thank you. Truly. Well, take care of each other, you hear? Of course. Please, stay safe, Thomas. With fortune, we'll do business again. Hoyle Vaur. Shall we return home? You must be hungry after all that. I'll get us some food. That was delicious. I can't remember the last time I had fresh meat. <laughs> no problem, mate. No, I have to say, who would have thought the bramble vines would make such a good soup? <laughs> well, I did learn a thing or two at the temple. Mm, it's late, but I don't feel tired at all. All right, you have some cards, don't you? How about we play a game? Well, I... Sure. Yes. Do you know how to play? Oh, no. Such things were frowned upon by the Mother Superior. She said games like these tainted the mind of the last head priestess. Hmm. Is that recognition in your eyes? Have you heard that before? Uh, never mind. Forgive my prying thoughts. So how about it? Would you teach me? <laughs> sure. It's been a while since I've played with anyone else, but I've memorized all the rules. Yesterday was such a blur, I can't even remember what happened, much less explain it all. Don't sweat it, me. I know these things are difficult to explain to others. Is that so? You expose them with fear of their troubles. Very well, it's enough of that. Let's get to Monster Slayer. Ha! That's the spirit, mate. <laughs> 